Namaskar and Salam. In this video, we will take the Hindi Longi Matra in Urdu. The Hindi Longi Matra is represented by Choti Ye in Urdu. We have taken Choti Ye in our previous videos on Choti and Badi Ye. Here, we will take the Choti Ye only in the function of Hindi Longi Matra. Just like the other letters, the Choti Ye also has four forms, detached, initial, medial, and the final form. The initial and medial forms have two nuktas below the sosha, the stroke for the letter, and the detached and the final forms are similar. The Hindi long e will come only in the medial and the final form. It will come in the initial form only when a non-connected letter comes before choti e. Let's take some words where choti e, which represents Hindi long e, comes in the middle. The first word is jina, meaning to live, the verb to live. The spelling is Jim plus Chotiye plus Noon plus Aleph. Jim is the first letter, so it will take the initial form and will connect to the Chotiye to make the long E matra on J, that is G. The Chotiye will take the medial form because it is in between Jim and Noon. The next letter, Noon, will also take the medial form because it is in between Chotiye and Aleph. And Aleph will take the final form and will add A matra to Na, that is Na. So, Jim plus Choti A, G, and Noon plus Aleph, Na. G, Na, G, Na. The next word is Zameen, meaning land. The spelling is Ze plus Meem plus Choti A plus Noon. Ze is the first letter, so it will take the initial form. Ze is also a non connective letter, so the next letter, Meem, will not connect to it and it will take the initial form. The next letter is Choti A and it will take the medial form because it is in between Meme and Noon. It will be written as a Sosha with two Nuktas below. And the final letter Noon will take the final form. So, Z, then Meme plus Choti A, Me, and then Noon. Z, Me, Na, Zameen. Third word is Iran, the country of Iran. The spelling is Alif plus Choti A plus Re, plus Aleph plus Noon. Here too, Choti A is in the middle but behaves as if it is in the beginning because the letter preceding it is non-connector Aleph. So you write Aleph then Choti A as initial. That means two Nuktas below the Sosha. The Choti A will connect to the next letter Re. The next letter Aleph will not connect to Re because Re is non-connector. And the final Noon will also not connect to Aleph because Aleph is also a non-connector letter. So, noon will be written detached. So, alif plus choti ye, e, then re plus alif, ra, and then noon, na, e, ra, na, iran. Let's take all the words together. The first two words, jina and zameen, have Hindi long e matra in the middle. So, choti ye is written as a medial letter with two nuktas below the sosha. The last word is iran. It also has choti ye in the middle, but because of alif, the non-connector letter preceding Choti A, the Choti A behaves as an initial letter and it is also written as Sosha with two nuktas below. Let's now take the Hindi longi at the end of a word. Hindi has a significant vocabulary with longi at the end. Many feminine nouns in singular and in longi like ladki, a girl. The variable feminine adjective also end in e such as peely, yellow. Let's take some words with the long e matra at the end. The first word is ladki, meaning girl. The spelling is lam plus re plus kaf plus choti a. So lam will take the initial form and will connect to re to make lad. The third letter kaf will not connect to re because re is non-connector. However, kaf will connect to choti a. Since choti a is the last letter, it will take the final form. So lam plus re lad. And kaf plus choti ye ki. Lad ki, lad ki. The next word is kali, meaning a bird, a flower bird. The spelling is kaf plus lam plus choti ye. So you write kaf as initial letter and then connect it to lam. Kaf in this case will take the alternate form because the next letter is lam. And lam will take the medial form because it is in between kaf and choti ye. The final letter choti ye will take the final form. So, kaf plus lam plus choti ye, kali, kali. Let's take a simple word G, the honorific particle meaning sir or madam. The spelling is jim plus choti ye. 
so gene will take the initial form and will connect to choti a which will take the final form so gene plus choti a g and the final word is pili yellow the feminine adjective pili in this word there are two choti a one comes in the middle and the other one comes at the end here both choti a will follow the rule the spelling here is pe plus choti a plus lam plus choti a so you write pe as the initial letter with three nuktas below the sosha and then comes choti a in the medial form because it is in between two letters so you write choti a as medial with two nuktas below the sosha and then comes lam also in the medial form because it is also in between two letters and the final choti a will take the final form which is similar to the detached form so here in this word you can see choti a in both medial and the final form so pe plus choti a p and then lam plus choti a li p li p li let's now take all the words together in which choti a comes at the end the first one is ladki second one is kali the third one is g and the final one is p li in the final one choti a comes as both medial and final so you can see that all the words have similar shape at the end in our next video we will take the hindi a ai and long e matra in the middle of a word see you there namaskar and salam